financial engineering hiyo course ilikuwa sawa unajua nikimaliza kampo nilikuwa napenda math jo actually math was the easiest subject for me in high school nili get a so niki join campus <laughs> financial engineering ilikuwa about math sasa nilikuwa na i mathematics why not ni simple hiyo itajim works unahitaji tu kujua utaduaje nikaanzia math basa the trick ni eh campus math tu kwa mbosi high school wangetuambia tu hivyo jo ile math ilikuwa pale ilikuwa tricky so still i really liked doing math that's when i really joined pia financial engineering eh but with time vya tuliona calc class na probability let's say we had to do it eh? where's the west school fees shakabo <laughs> <laughs> ah bookkeeping bookkeeping ni ile leo umeuza like what have you sold today you know if you don't have what you're selling you don't know what you need to restock on so bookkeeping inasaidia unaandika chenye umeuza eh inasaidia like to know what you're selling and what you should add on na pia inakusaidia to know if you're making profits or losses ka biashara ina grow ama high grow hiyo ndio nzuri ya bookkeeping bookkeeping initially si kitu kubwa ni kuandika tu today i've sold two pieces of jeans three pieces of shoes nini nini blah blah like you have it you have it there you know what you're doing cuz i'm on top of the world i'm on top of the world oh our losses our losses in terms in kwa clients on each gavia to how you size hiyo ndio nasema the biggest loss you can get unapata msel kwa taka 41 anaitisha 43 and you still have to bring the 41 because you have to maintain the client so unapata the 43 inakuwa like it's acting like the losses but eventually inakuwa kama pia stock eh people not make the sizes the other losses ni una get gi umetuma rider because mostly tunatumia gata wale wa bolt like i had an incident nilituma rider wa bolt aenda ka deliver lovington he really delivered but the remaining ha kuleta he decided ate ane zava by the way na hata ni pass since ametumwa Another kind of loss that you go through ni ile una buy something you expecting it to sell out na haija sell out so you learn from it unajua like this design haina mafans wengi maybe this type of shoe didn't what work we like vizuri so you change the design and the fashion uh, my biggest achievement ni kwa nimeacha pia ku graduate iko rais number 2 ilikuwa kufungua shop cause mostly ilikuwa online Bottles in a bucket full of ice. Yeah. Better make room, room, hit a Lambo. Celebrate. Uh, on my biggest achievements, I had to transfer now to graduate. I had to join campus first year. When I had to join campus first year, it was quite interesting. The first year and second year, I think things as good as me develop. So now, because you're doing something, either the topic in the main year, Cal class one, probability two. But as you go, Cal class four, Cal class six, the more probabilities, it was quite normal. Uh, so I still we had to do the band the midnight toilet eh? lazima tugesoma tukamaliza actually watu wengi wali drop out but we managed to graduate uh, on the other achievement ya biz biz nilianzia online so actually I didn't have a shop at first nimekuwa niki sell online niki grow niki save capital then during the years kuweka ku save do nini nikafungua nika get capital kufungua shop and they managed to open a shop actually siku anzia hapa nilianzia tukishare shop na mse so because still bado nilikuwa no they taking the risk ya kufungua shop on my own paying the bills nikakuwa bado time tuna ko share was saving or saving and then i started like 2020 nilikuwa na why don't i try doing it on my own and that was the biggest achievement you nilifungua shop yangu and it's been doing well over the years we are still open and we are going to open a bigger one another one another one another one another one uh, another achievement through opening a shop tumeza ku create employment uh, one way ni kama through deliveries so deliveries open is such that mtu order unasema nataka 1 2 3 like either shoes and jeans na your area like ni langata lovington thika road so to be delivered kuna riders we use mostly boda boda guys and they charge delivery varying on the area and as i get something mostly when i get the and as i get maybe 300 400 depending on the number of deliveries you are mob but a distance mostly you are for so peer to the photographers when you chukua mostly pictures za cladi see post na videos pia na pia and say dia in marketing achievement ingine pia ni tumeweza kuwa na influencers who help us market eh wanatusaidia kutoka hapo nje wanatupostia nguo zetu shoes 
and they also get something from the business. <laughs>